Ladies and gentlemen, we are back in solo leveling Arise because I didn't realize this. I was not going to re-roll in the game, but the people on Discord, massive shout out to everyone on Discord, told me that it's like a one minute re-roll after you do your first playthrough, which is absolutely ridiculous. You guys know I love re-rolling in games, but because this is like the open beta, the quote unquote soft launch, I was just going to grind it, play with what I had, and then maybe re-roll a global. But after I learned this, you know, my, my, my re-roll bug just gets me and I have to start doing some re-rolls. So I want to show you guys how how you can do like these one minute re-rolls now it's 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 definitely something you want to do on phone i can't get the game to work on emulator at the moment uh that will obviously change probably when we get to global launch but i want to i'm just on a fresh account here and i want to show you guys but on mobile you can have guest accounts whereas on pc client which i'm showing you right now uh you could only log in with email gmail or apple i think are the options so you do have to have multiple email accounts which i have a million because i play a million games and make like a new account every time so i'm just going to do some rerolls here and show you guys how quick it is now the first playthrough that you do actually takes probably 20 minutes to half an hour ish but you'll get a notice on the screen once you finish the tutorial in that and it literally says you've finished the tutorial um and after you do that you can go into your settings and just uh, like reset your account it takes you back to the home screen and then you just log in and you get this message so the reason i'm getting this message is because i've already cleared all this stuff on the pc client i've just logged into a different gmail so now now it's giving me this option and I can just skip the tutorial. This is just, this, is, this, is, this blows my mind how good re-rolling is in this game because I love re-rolling. So like you can, you can soak some serious, serious time into this. Let me just turn the volume down just a little bit. All right. And we do have at the moment, the other thing is we do have some um, bit latency issues towards server. Hopefully that's all cleaned up by the time we get to global. But like every time you like finish a mission, you gotta wait like five seconds for it to like reconnect for you to be able to do stuff. It is a little bit buggy at the moment, but I think that's just stuff that can be ironed out. So this is where we get to, this is where we get to when we re-jump into the game after we've either reset our account and we go straight into this. So basically on your first playthrough, once you get these check-in rewards, that's when you've passed the initial phase. Uh, and so now we've done that. So this is where we are. Now I want to quickly show you guys. So basically if you want to reset your account, you just come over here to account settings um, and instead of log out, on phone, there'll be a reset account button. And that's what you do. The delete account button is one of those 30 day delayed ones. So you can't do it on PC, but yeah, you could do it on phone. You just reset account, takes you back to the home screen, happy days. So that's what we got. So over here, what we're gonna do is uh, you, we're gonna jump straight into summons. Uh, and basically when we look at it now, I've heard people say different methods. I'll do like a more in-depth reroll guide once we get to global, because global, we will have pre-registration rewards as well. So maybe you can do like, people have talked about doing a couple extra missions i just don't see the point to get like an extra couple summons to a temple i'll just throw some singles in so what we're going to do first is set our wish list i'm just going with this i still don't know what the best wish list is this is just me screwing around so then i'm going to do uh, a temple here because as you can see we got 13 pulls saved up so let's go ahead and pop ourselves a temple see if we can get anything you know te te test the waters test the luck test the rng see how you go and nothing on that one. You do still have the chance of the fake out, which I found out in my uh, in my reroll video, but no fake out on that one. So that, that's all we got. We got nothing in that. Cool beans, no worries. All right, confirm. Then we're going to do our couple little singles that we have here. We do have some achievements that we can collect, which will get us like another one summon here and a couple others. Now, the reason I'm not doing a 10 pool, which I could do a 10 pool and use my gems to make up uh, the remainder of the 10 pool if I went and collected my achievements first, but it's because, uh, you know, you want to use premium currency on the premium banner. So what we're going to do first is we're going to come over here. We're going to go to our achievements. And we're going to go ahead and collect all these achievements here. Uh, that gives us one summon pass. Uh, and then we're going to go into the codex and this is like as you summon more you get like free free premium currency for however many things you've collected uh so this is rng based how much you'll get depending on what your first 10 pool really does uh you don't need to do that one actually uh and so that's that now we've got 2000 so you need 2500 for a 10 pool so if you wanted to fish around for an extra 500 to do a single 10 pool here you can but i don't see the point i'm happy just to burn through singles the skip button comes up pretty quick and you can skip pretty easily so that was my last summon there now we can go onto this banner and we can start punching some summons into here and uh and see how we go and, and like like i said some people may hate doing singles I don't really, it doesn't really bother me personally. Uh, the other thing you can do to speed that up a little bit is before you do your first summon, you can actually just buy all the summons you can get uh, and we can just go purchase. 
and then you've got them all and you can just spam those singles without having that pop up every time and uh, you can do this now the best account i've got so far uh on my phone is one where i got uh i got the the exclusive banner unit in two summons but i got nothing else from my uh my 10 pool and my initial pools on the uh, dude nice she's an sr but I, I really like this character i think she's wicked um but yeah i got nothing else on the other one so maybe i'll keep rolling but i think i think getting the exclusive banner character in two pools uh is something i'm pretty happy with so i'll probably just stick with that one but i will do a few more and that's a basic look what i'm gonna do is i'm just gonna show you guys how quick this is uh i can't i, I can't do the whole thing online because i gotta get into my emails and stuff but i'm just gonna literally uh all, all i do here all, all i do from here is i'm just gonna turn the game off then I'm going to reboot it up. This is on PC. Like I said, on mobile, it's so much easier. You'll just be heading into the settings. Uh, you'll go uh, reset account, which will be another button option up here. And then it'll reset. Uh, but what I'm going to do is uh, game version. It doesn't have my server listed here, does it? Game settings. There is servers in this one. My other accounts on like server 10. Maybe I don't register a server yet until I get to a certain point. But um, but yeah, I'm going to bounce over to another one. We'll do another re-roll pull through. But like I said, these re-rolls are incredibly easy after you've grinded an account once. Okay, there we go. I closed the game, opened it up, logged into another Gmail that I have, and away we go. So now we're jumping straight back into the game. Like I said, this is going to be so fun at global because uh, I'm, I'm still figuring out how servers work. Like I open up my settings on my main account or the, the account that I played through and it tells me that, um, okay, there we go. Uh, it tells me that I'm on server 10. So it's a multi-server game, but I don't think you can select your server. Make sure you always tick that as well. Skip tutorial. Uh, but I don't think you can select your server. So it puts you in a, it's like a shard based system. If you guys have played shard based systems, I don't know how guild, like, I, I don't even know if there's guilds. Like I haven't got far enough to check everything out, but I don't know how all the features interact with servers and stuff like that. I'll make more videos on that in the future, but just so you know, there is like, seems to be a server based system, but I don't know exactly how it works yet, but I just wanted to show you this for rerolls because dude if you're like me and you enjoy enjoy re-rolls like i wasn't gonna do in this game because i'm like i don't want to do the half hour re-rolls like it's just not fun but dude this is sick you just get to straight into summoning and honestly mad props for putting this in the game i think this is an amazing feature to add in the game so literally you just keep jumping into new accounts like i said better on phone because you can do it as guests and you don't have to worry about having a million gmails but lucky i have a million gmails so we're just gonna jump straight in once again uh, i'm gonna set our wish list here boom 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 once again don't copy my wish list i don't know if it's best i'll make more videos on that closer to global launch but you know we're, we're just playing around so let's go ahead and see boom boom nothing okay we don't get the emergency thing do we get a fake out please give us a fake out yeah i just want i i, I just i just want an ssr please please game no fake out all right rip rip the dream all right confirm let's do our three singles here skip it like I said, after that first 10 pull, you can go into your achievements, get enough pulls that you can then just punch another 10 pull out using your gems. But I, like I said, I, pref I think it's better to use it on the uh, exclusive banner uh, would be my play. So now we can, now that we've done that, we can go and hit over here. We can go to achievements. We go get that extra single pull. Happy days. We go over here. We go to codex. We get ourselves some extra summon currency for the exclusive banner. And then we're really cooking from this point on. All right, let's do that. Let's do that. All right, sick. Now we can go back to not the shop, not the shop. That's not where we wanted to go. Like I said, sometimes when you get into menus, it's uh, it's a little bit laggy on getting around, but hopefully I do fix up some server issues. Let's pop this single summon here. Boom. Oh, dude, I, I thought it was giving me like a, a wicked animation, but no, I just missed, missed, didn't hit the right window for the, the click. All right, seven summons. Eight summons, is it eight? Yeah, it's eight. Dude, so close. But yeah, once again, at, at global, we should have pre-registration rewards and stuff, and this should be a lot better. But let's just do this. Boom. Boom. I, I do... I, I wish it was one of those games where it's like, you've got eight summon tickets, you can do an eight pull. That would be epic. That would be epic. I love games that do that, so you don't have to do, like, singles if you're, like, really close to it. Dude, there we go. Dude, this is the this is the banner character. Dude. Okay, now I've got two accounts. Now I've got two accounts with the banner character. Now this one did take a few more summons than the other one. The other one only took uh two summons. But hey, there you go. I 
But like I said, rerolls in this game, super fun. If I could have got him plus one of the other characters, I think that would have been pretty sick. But in general, I mean, maybe I just rolled. No, I'm, you guys, you, I, this is this is the problem. I'm a pathetic rerolling degenerate. Once I start rerolling, I can't stop, and I'm gonna keep doing it. I can't help it. Oh, I need some help, guys. And then I know, once Global comes out, I'm going to start fresh again, and I'm going to reroll again. <laughs> Dude, I'm such a loser. Anyway, that is it. I'm pretty impressed with the reroll system. The The banner rates are kind of annoying with the 50-50 to 75-25, then to 100. I mean, you get shafted, so that means rerolling is going to be more important. So I think it's fantastic that they've at least made rerolling good uh, as a bit of a compensation. I would prefer if they made the banners just like... <sighs> Just a bit more generous on the uh, on the rates, like because if you get shafted on rates and you lose that 50-50, then you lose a seventy-five. Like, dude, that is a long time summoning. But I'll have more thoughts on that in the future. But hey, that is re-rolling in this game. It is pretty sick. I'm gonna have some fun with it as always, guys. Thanks for watching. Hope you have an awesome day, and I look forward to seeing you in the next one. Cheers.